Hey there trainers, welcome back. You are with Peter City Gym and we're going to go ahead and carry on with our playthrough of Pokemon Infinite Fusion today for Fan Game Friday. How y'all doing? I hope you had a fantastic week. Um, I am loving this game so far. It is, um, it is quite honestly ridiculous, but it has some of the coolest um, Pokemon designs that I have seen. Um, oh man. Uh, Pukumuku combined with Charmander, surprisingly awesome. Um, this is Jelly Roll. He is my son, and he is perfect. <laughs> um, there's, there's literally nothing wrong with him whatsoever, and uh, I will, I will love him till the day I die. Wow. Look at his little face. He's just so happy to have knocked out that hoot hoot. Anyway, um, we have another Nidoran mail. We're going to pop it in the PC for now. I think Nidoking King fusions are basically going to be just amazing. Um, and I, I want to have access to as many of those as possible. So I just took the opportunity to snag an extra Nidoran mail. Go ahead and pop him in the PC. Deposit Pokemon, and it's going to be you. Box one. All right, and then let's go ahead and just uh, arrange the Pokemon so that our newest fusion is up at the front. And then we'll heal, and then we'll be on our way. All right, what do we got this time? Another Hoot Hoot. So many Hoot Hoots. Well, that's fine. Rocky Road will take care of Hoot Hoot. No issues, I believe. With its stellar combo of rock and electric. Oops. Um, let's see. We'll do Bite. Done. Ooh. Vicious. Okay, back to Viridian Forest. Oh, it looks a little bit different this time. Okay, Phantom. Again, probably not one that I really want. Ha! You got poisoned. But the, uh, oh, and we got confused. That's not great. Ah, come on, really? Alright, we'll switch Pokemon. Let's go for Jelly Roll. Normal and Poison will be immune to uh, ghost type attacks like that. Alright, Peck. Oh, wow. Did not get to move a single square. All right. And it's another phantom. It wants revenge. I guess. Go for jelly roll again. Oh my gosh. I keep hitting the Pokemon button by accident. Heck. Come on. No, don't do that. There we go. That's what we want. Okay, what do we got? <gasps> Joltik! Oh, we already have an electric type, though. Hmm. Spider web, I don't think that's gonna hurt. Yeah. Oh, and we got the confusion. Very good. Come on. I mean, it might be worth catching. Oh, well, uh, that decision was made for me, I guess. We might find another one, though. That Joltik looked really big. I don't know why it was so large. 
This is a dead end. Let's battle. There's an item over there. That's why I'm coming for it. Alright. Stuff Yuri. <gasps> oh my goodness, it's cute. Leer, sure. Um I want that. I, I want that that Pokemon. Look at how adorable that is. Um oops. Is it a fighting type or is it just a normal type? It's just normal. Bide. Oh, that's not good. Um, we'll switch out for um, for Rocky Road. Yeah, no. Right. I think Rocky Road's the best thing because we've already hit it once with Bide. There we go. But it's not going to be very effective. Perfect. Done. Oh, man. Jelly Roll wants to roll in double kick. Yes, please. We will go over... We'll go over Focus Energy, actually. Farsley? What is that? Galarian, far-fetched, and a bonsley. All right, <laughs> because why? Why wouldn't it be that? Um, gosh, it's a little higher level than us. Ah, uh, let's see. Good and plenty. We'll bring in good and plenty. Oh my goodness, that's ridiculous. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, why do I keep doing that? Ember. It's not very effective? What in the world? Bonslide. It's not a grass type. I'm a I'm a dummy. Not very effective there either. Sand attack? Oh gosh. Uh we'll use bide. That did a decent amount of damage, all right. Okay, there we go. That should do it. Done. Perfect. Villanova wants to learn double team. Double team is a good move. Um, we'll go over growth. Good plenty to go to level 10. No. I'm not going to learn Smokescreen. Uh, let's see. Fenursa. So that's a Fanfi and a Teddy Ursa? Uh, it's going to be a ground type then. That is going to be cute. Oh, it's not. It's... Wow, that... It, oh. I don't care for that much. Oh, really? Come on. Okay. Bite. Not very effective. Okay, bite. Bite. There we go. Wow, yeah, that's... I was expecting something like a little stuffed elephant man, and it just was not that. Okay. Well, at least we got a little bit of money out of it. We gotta go back to the Pokemon Center, so I will meet you guys back here. Oh, the, the weird shading is back. I don't care for that. Oh, a Venipede. Hello. 
If you can survive this pick, I'll catch you. Oh, you used Defense Girl, so maybe I can get another pick in without killing you. I did. Alright. Calculated risk. Oh my gosh, what would Vanipede look good combined with? There's so many things that I can think of. Vanipede Drapion. Vanipede Ponyta would be amazing. That's cute. I like that one. Oh, that one's neat too. Mm, we'll go with this one. It discovers what is going on around it by using the feelers on its head and tail. It is brutally aggressive. Okay. Actually, I wonder if there are additional spites for uh, Jelly Roll. I did not check. Um, yeah, no, we're sticking with that one for sure. Oh my goodness. A little shroomish. Alright, if you survive this pick, I'll catch you. You did! Way to go, buddy. I love Breloom, and I'm assuming that Breloom could come up with some really cool um, mixed sprites as well. Uh, let's see. Oh, that sprite for sure. It loves to eat damp, composted soil in forests. If you enter a forest after a long rain, you can see many shroomish feasting on composted soil. Not right now. Okay, so they've been added to the party, but I really want to just get to the next area so I can heal. Um, we are... oh wow, well, yeah, no, actually we're in the super early area of Viridian Forest, so let's just go back to the town and heal, and I'll meet you guys back up here. Okay, we're back in the forest. We got an item here. What do we got? Oh, another Pokeball. Very good. Need plenty of those. I wonder if we can sand attack. Eh, I think it's just got sand attack and tackle. You should be able to knock it out if a couple of these can hit. Oh my goodness. You know what? I'm over it. I'm done. We're leaving. What do you mean I couldn't get away? Oh, poison point. Well, so you're gonna you're gonna get knocked out one way or the other. Haha. <laughs> Evasion this rose, so you can't hit me. I can't hit you. or are out of stalemate, but you're the only one that's poisoned. So enjoy that, I guess. It just seems such a shame not to catch it. Done. All right. Oh, which sprites are we going to use? Oh, that's so cute. That one. This is it. 100%. It has an extremely sharp sense of direction. It can unerringly return home to its nest, however far away it may be removed from its familiar surroundings. Uh, store to the PC. No, we're not going to give it a nickname right now. We're only going to nickname team members. Okay. Oh, we got to fight this guy. Hey, look at my cool bug Pokemon. Do you actually have bugs, though? That's my question. Do you have bugs or do you have chickots? Oh, Chikorita and Ralts. Ooh. 
That is very cool. I like that a lot. Um, having said that, I'm gonna go for a uh, jelly roll. Oh my goodness. Peck. Yeah, see, this is not a bug type either, my friend. So. Alright. Vanilla wants to learn water sports. Uh, no. Oh, Bug, bug Catcher Jim. We have the same name. Uh, Vena Raid. So, Venomoth? Venomat? Vena something. Or maybe Venipede. With Remoraid. Would be my guess. So, we're gonna go for Rocky Road. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's so weird. <laughs> I want to know what it evolves into, though. Oh, I didn't even see what that was. But we'll stay in with, uh, with Rocky Road. Palax. Oh my gosh. That's ridiculous. Okay, we do have an antidote, so we're, we're okay. I mean, the last two had bug elements, so I guess it's fine. Baby doll eyes. Uh, no. No, how could this happen? Well, uh, it's just a matter of whose Pokemon is stronger, I guess. Okay. And then we need the antidote. We only have one potion left. That's kind of rough. All right. Let's go. Got another antidote. That's good. I'll take that. Okay. And then this way. Oh, another Joltik. Maybe I can catch this one. I bet Joltik and Venipede would look really cool, actually. Could make it into an electric poison type, I think? I'm running low on Pokeballs. But I think, uh, well, we already have an electric type, so, well, we'll take a look. We'll see what it is. Oh, almost had it. Cheeky. Stay in the ball. Done. All right. That's more what I'm sort of thinking of when I think Joltik. You know what? I really like the, the classic look. We'll use this sprite. They attach themselves to large-bodied Pokemon and absorb static electricity, which they store in an electric pouch. Add to the party. No, not at this time. But we are going to splice them. We are going to splice them. Right, Venipede and Joltik. Okay, let's see, Bug Electric or Bug Poison. Oh, okay, so we don't really get to pick the types. Bug Electric is exactly the same. Um, 
Well, this one looks like it's going to be more scolipedish, so we'll go with that. Oh, it looks so neat. Your Pokemon were fused into Jolpeed. Okay, oh, and we have a couple of options. Oh, that thing looks cool. Why does... I don't get what that is supposed to be. That looks like a Karamon. Yeah, this one. It discovers what is going on around it by using the feelers on its head and tail. They attach themselves to large body Pokemon and absorb static electricity. Um, we'll go for Poison Point. Go for Rash Nature. Combine move sets. Jollipede learns String Shot and Absorb. Spider Web. What does Spider Web do? It snares the target with Thin Gooey Silk. Um, no, we don't want that. Don't really need that. Thunder Wave, though, 100% we want. Uh, we'll take that over. String Shot. Okay. Let's go. Oh, wait. We came down this way. Ah, gosh. Go, Vanilla. I think we should just be able to knock this one out with very little problem. Uh, absorb, really? You're not gonna get a lot. Done. Okay, and we should be just about at the end. Okay, oh my gosh. We're so close! Another Shroomish. I do want to get Vanilla's level up just a little bit because uh, it's going to be our main attacker against Brock, I believe. Though, having said that, um, he may not have all Rock types. Oh, this one's a level 5 one, that's why it's so much stronger. Ooh, what an interesting area. Okay, definitely coming back here once we get cut. Uh. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a Budu and a Weedle? It's got to be at least part poison, right? Gosh. I do have to wonder what the evolved... Final form is going to look like? Roserade and Beedrill? Okay, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Okay, and into Pewter City we go, and that'll be the episode. We are here, let's go to the Pokemon Center. Let's go, let's go. Thank you for waiting. All right, and that's going to be it for the episode, guys. I want to thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. I'm very much looking forward to catching you in the next one. But till then, take care. Bye.